Oh, wow! The color burst the packaging. Grab your rusty scissors. It's time to crack open the package you've been waiting for over a month. <laughs> With all the high suit lapidarian jewelry tools around, you think I could do better than rusty scissors. There's this little swag package of goodies and a big chunky one. It's heavy. That's my parcel. This bag is like better than a baby. That definitely would have broken the stork's back. And the postal fee for the parcel. Sorry, Nick. I have some water here to give the contents of the bag a bath for you, so you can see them better. Deja vu, bursting forth with all that opaly goodness. This is a Boulder Opal parcel from Nick Hoops in Australia. I'm happy to know him through Roy Lehman of Roy's Rocks fame. He's got a channel here on YouTube. Definitely check him out. A link to his stuff is in the description. He shows polishing of opal start to finish. It's really instructional. Awesome stuff. I'm going straight for the goodie bag. I had to ditch the scissors for a knife. Rookie unboxing maneuver. Also, don't worry, I'm about to fix the focus. We're seeing the blurry world like I do without glasses. Ooh, yeah, look at these gems. It's like we're having dessert first. They're begging to be set free of this bag. Let's get to it. This is an oceanic beauty. Waves of hues from sea foam to ultramarine blue. I'm going to call this bachelor number one. I have quite a lineup of things to polish here and I want your help. Vote in the comments for which one to start with. I'm borrowing that good idea from Roy. We'll take a quick look at these lovely cabs. These are doublets. It's a lapidary term for materials stacked or doubled up to make a cabochon. It's often used for opal when the seam of opal is too thin to cab alone or too weak. It can also be used to literally back up the color or enhance it. This dynamic duo is opal on top of ironstone. That's the dark material below, which is the host for boulder opal. Introducing bachelor number two. This gorgeous hunk likes moonlight walks on the beach and playing the ukulele. Just gaze into that deep blue with flashes of green and some delicious purple to swim around in. From the reflection, you can see the saw mark getting into this seam to get the color. Boulder opal is not a gimme. You have to work for it. Next up, of course we have bachelor number three. A not shy, life of the party, destined to wear the lampshade at some point during the evening kind of guy. And Karen finally finds her voice during the unboxing. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is so good. Look at the flash on that. Way. This beautiful a nice stone. Wish the camera was picking up on that better. Hard to see how good that is. Okay, so that was the little bag of treats that was generously added in by Nick. 
was not part of my parcel and it's amazing already like I have the value of my parcel I think here already I'm amazed how cool this is gonna be so fun to play with all right so let's get into the big bag okay so excited <laughs> there were squeals that I didn't get on the video when my husband walked through the door with the, the bag <laughs> from the mail. He got the mail today. I've been getting the mail every day waiting for this parcel. The one day I don't go out there and get it, but my husband got the kisses. So let's see what's in the big bag. It's heavy. Little bit, I guess. This piece is just already trying to come out, and there's some flash right on the corner of this already as well. <laughs> okay, I lost you there for a minute. Hopefully, I didn't miss out on too much of the unboxing here. Um, I gotta say that there's a, a lot to this that is maybe more fun than going and buying the material at Gem Show. I used to be at the Tucson Gem Show and get my opal there. And you get what you get. And um, there was something of the, you know, the novelty of surprise with this that, um, you know, I get to, it's a mystery until I, I get to get in there and uncover the goodies. Okay, I'm losing my daylight here. Had to reset my phone. <laughs> Lo and behold, I didn't have any space left. I wonder how that happens. So, let's see if I can't get the lighting here better. The daylight was nicer. Let's see if you can't get a look at that. There's some nice color in there to go after. There's something right there, and there's something right there, and there's that. That should be fun to play with. I'm a carver, so having uneven terrain is like throwing down a challenge. I like it. Okay, next, next one. Ooh, goodness gracious, man. They keep on coming. Thank you, Nick. Look at that. Look at that color. Nice. Oh, can I wear all of these at the same time? Yeah, like Wilma Flintstone and her pebble necklace. This is kind of fun. If I go live and do voiceovers, I can heckle myself. It gets thin right there, but that might make two stones or if I'm careful, something, something creative <laughs> again at the carving, but ah, the colors are just driving me nuts. Opal. That is why opal is the queen of gems. My favorite of all time. Don't tell the other rocks. Okay. And oh, look at that. Look at that right there. Great lights. Oh. Reds. I don't know if the camera's picking up on the reds really. Can you see that? It seems like darn near everybody who takes pictures of opals with their camera complains about the reds. I'm totally getting it now. Still unboxing. I announced that because Steve just walked in and now he's watching me over my back. last. 
Yeah, right? Look at that. The red. <laughs> there needs to be more in that stone. cheese stuff in the matrix. Looks like there's color in there though to go after. That'll be easy. That'll probably be my first project right there because it's already already little ready to to lap away at. Let's see that in there. Yep. Very exciting. I, I know what I'm doing tonight. <laughs> All night long. <laughs> Let's have a look at this. Your singing is on the video. Yep. <laughs> oh, yes. Look at that. Sun's out in Oregon. This is cause for celebration. Maybe it's the Australian aspect. Look at the red rolling through there. Woo! Woohoo! Look at that! Oh my gosh! That's so pretty. Is that in focus? Are you seeing the skies? So good. So good. <laughs> I gotta see this one again sun again. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be playing. Ah, I'm putting iron stone mud on it <laughs> with my fingers. How dare I? Oh, this is beautiful. Yeah. So, we'll recap the sun for some of you guys. Alright. Time to vote. Leave it in the comments. Will it be bachelor number one? Oh my 
gosh, I do not know what I'm going to start with. It's going to be so hard to know which way to go. Help me decide. These are out of order. Is it bachelor number three? So beautiful. I think I'm sounding kind of redundant right now. <laughs> Come up with some synonyms for beautiful, marvelous, and gorgeous, and stunning. And here's bachelor number two. Leave your vote in the comments. I like that this one has striations and know what the proper vernacular for, you know, more particulate flash. Maybe y'all can help me with that. Leave it in the comments. For all the years I've been hanging around Opals, to be honest, I haven't really spent the time to get the lexicon down for the different, uh, Stammering there. All, all the different styles of flash. And there's flagstone and rolling and pin fire and harlequin. <laughs> you know how you listen to ambient music? go to sleep or what have you to calm down you know, or listen to the ocean or a river the sounds I could just look at opal all day like I should just make a really long video of <laughs> the flash and opal it's mesmerizing It'd be easy to never work it and just stare at it but then I don't have the restraint for that. Believe, believe me, we're getting into this for sure. Like as soon as I press stop on the camera, and I owe you guys some other videos. So unfortunately, some of this is gonna have to wait in line. All right, well. Thank you to Nick and this amazing parcel of Australian Boulder Oval. And we're going to be seeing a lot of this in some upcoming videos, some jewelry making, some cab, cab making some how to get that color off of that stone and some of this is going to be a serious learning experience for me too so I'll bring you along thanks we've got the obsidian project video coming up with the giveaway so subscribe it helps us for more information check out our website at ozonefineart.com keep creating